Let's start with the big picture. Whenever you see an equation that contains fractions, ultimately you're going to want to multiply by the denominators. But more specifically, we need to break these denominators down so that we can multiply by the least common denominator. That first denominator, 3u minus 18, can be factored. Let's take a 3 out, leaving us with u minus 6. Redistribute that in your head just to verify. 3 times u is 3u, and 3 times negative 6 is negative 18. I'm going to go ahead and rewrite what we have so far with the denominator replaced with 3 times u minus 6. Now that the denominators are completely factored, we can see that the common denominator would be 3 and u minus 6. So let's multiply both sides of the equal sign by both 3 and u minus 6. Ultimately, when we distribute the 3 times u minus 6 to the left, we're going to end up putting 3 times u minus 6 next to each one of these. Now we're ready to multiply. Let's cancel out what we can. In the first piece of multiplication, that u minus 6 cancels, and so does the 3. All we have left is 6. Now moving to the right, nothing cancels, so I'll just bring that down. Keep in mind it's multiplication. On the right side of the equal sign, those u minus 6s are going to cancel, leaving me with 2 and 3. Again, that's multiplication. All those fractions are gone, so we're ready to start simplifying. 6 minus, now 3 times 3 is 9, and we still have u minus 6. equals, and 2 times 3 is 6. Let's continue simplifying that left side. Distributing negative 9, I'm going to have negative 9 times u is negative 9u, and negative 9 times negative 6 is positive 54. Bringing down that equals 6. We can still simplify some more on the left. The 6 and 54 make 60, so we have negative 9u plus 60 equals 6. Let's move those numbers to the other side. So if we subtract 60 from both sides, we'll have negative 9u is equal to negative 54. Getting rid of multiply by negative 9, we'll divide by negative 9, and we end up getting positive 6. Now, unlike Algebra 1, if you had a simple equation like x plus 5 equals 9 and solved, checking would be optional just to make sure you didn't make an arithmetic error. But when your original equation has a variable in the denominator, checking is not optional. So I must replace the u in the original equation with what I found. So I'm going to go in and replace every u with the number 6. So putting in 6, notice when I begin to simplify, I end up with 6 over 0, danger, danger, minus 3 equals 2 over 0. You cannot divide by 0. That means this does not work out, so we're going to go back and say, no, u does not equal 6. That was the only solution we found, so since we're throwing that one out, this is no solution.